London weather. It has a bad reputation. In fact, <laughs> British weather in general does. But is it really that bad? In October 2022, we decided we'd like to find out for ourselves. We spent 100 days making a daily video documenting the weather. What surprised us was not only the weather itself, but how much life changed within those 100 days. What is London weather really like? Join us as we spend 100 days finding out. Hey everyone. So anytime we have friends come into London, the first thing they ask is, how bad is the weather? And you know what? It's not actually that bad. So many reviews online say that London is an amazing place to visit, but the weather was the only letdown of their stay here. But don't just take my word for it. Let's have a look at some of the reviews people are saying about London weather. Stay away from the UK. Much less likely to kill you. Crappy, gloomy and depressing. Ouch, that last one was pretty brutal, right? But with forecasters such as the BBC now predicting days of almost non-stop rain, after one of the hottest summers on record, I might add, we thought it would be interesting to see for ourselves. Come follow me. Oh, just one more thing. It's mid-October now, so might need to take this with me and probably best to put this on too. Let's go. So currently on the balcony, it's slightly chilly, but it is mid-October and it's still t-shirt weather. So join us and strap in as we brace ourselves for 100 days of London weather. I hope you've liked this every day. <laughs> We're coming to the end of what's been a beautiful day in London. Day one, there goes the sun, see you tomorrow. Good morning. Day two from London, another beautiful day here in the city. I'm gonna go back home and work from the balcony, I think. Whoever said London weather, was rubbish. Was talking rubbish. My friend has just arrived in London from New York, so I thought what a great opportunity to ask him what he thinks of London weather. Morning, day three. It's about nine degrees outside at the moment. So it's half two on Bankside. This is the London weather that I know I love. Gray, it may not be a heat wave, but still t-shirt weather. Four days in and uh, so far so good still yet to see any rainfall day five and we finally have some rain it's only a light drizzle mid-october and the only rain we've seen so far is uh is a bit of drizzle i think that's pretty good going we're in farringdon and it's really really windy today this is how london weather is man you try to go anywhere it's just wind central all the time. Still no sign of this torrential downpour uh, predicted, which goes to show that London weather really isn't that bad. So day eight, uh, 
hands. Almost literally the calm after the storm. Last night it rained. It rained, it rained, it rained, and it rained. It rained all night long. I went to bed and it was raining so hard. And I woke up and it was still raining. It stopped probably about two, three hours ago. Typical London, there's not actually that much sign of it left apart from like puddles on the rooftops just here. As you can see, it's the most beautiful day today. Shades are back out. I grabbed the door handle just now and it was actually too hot to hold. This is mad, this is absolutely beautiful. This is definitely not what the BBC predicted when they predicted 17 days of rainfall for London weather. Not at all. Morning, day 10. There must have been a lot of wind overnight because the streets are absolutely covered in leaves. So it's day 11 and it's here, the dreaded rainfall. It's been raining all morning, I think, for the first time in a while. It's one of those days where you look out the window and you're just like, I'm so glad I'm not going to work today. Today's weather is quite grey, probably tell it's pretty windy as well. It's raining all night long, but it's a really, really nice day today. Squinting is, uh, yeah, sun's out, such a beautiful day. It's about 15 degrees as well. After the initial sunshine and mild weather, things started to go south pretty quickly. Later in the day, it started to rain. And rain. And rain. And rain. Before long, the London streets were flooded. So much so, even traffic struggled to get through. So we spent the best part of two days locked away in the flat or down the local bar with their resident dog. The calm after the storm. What a beautiful day. London is awash with Halloween decorations. What's also here is blue sky. Leaves, leaves, leaves everywhere. Don't come to London if you don't want to kick some leaves. We've had a couple of uh, torrential rainstorms, but it hasn't been anywhere near what they said it would be. 17 days of rain or whatever it was. There's so much beauty here, even when the sky's grey, even when the Thames is the colour of sludge. Now, it's all a part of the London experience. Seriously, when you're in London in like autumn or winter, Part of the appeal, just put on a big coat and just get on with it. Don't want to sleep in, cause I got something to prove. I gotta take what I hate and finally make a move. I think of you and all the shit you don't do. Well, I'ma make hella shit sure that I don't become you. Ha! London's so lovely when the weather's like this. It's actually 20 degrees. No regrets, yeah, I'll tie up my chest I'll never forget what it's like to be in debt Been stabbed in the back bed I'll show you what happens Pass me the mic and I'll show you with action I feel this pain, you already know Turn that to gains, let my money show I've got these things that I can't let go Watch me turn this life into something that you can never own I feel this pain, you already know Turn that
the last day on the caravan park. We've been here for two weeks now and the sun is shining. It's a pretty beautiful day. We're all packed up and we're ready to go back to London. Lovely sunny day. It'll be amazing. Morning everyone. Just look at those grey colours. You guessed it, back in London. Back to the rain. Back running in the city of London. So good to be outside. It's about four degrees, but the sun's out. Oh. So nice to be back in London, I'll tell you that. day 56 so coming to the end of six weeks now amazing to see how much the, the weather's changed in that time so they've just given out snow for the next few days we've already seen little bits of snow already now the floor is completely covered in leaves when i started doing this in the first couple of weeks at least it was sunny every day and it's really really changed i would say the last three weeks the temperature has really dropped to about three or four degrees at the moment so yeah, it's really changed. The air is quite beautiful today. It's really nice. It's, uh, it's chilly, but really, really, really crisp. They've given out snow this week in London, so we'll see how that gets on. Uh, but for the time being, it's beautiful wintry weather. I love it, so nice. It's about two degrees outside. <laughs> Snow is about to arrive at any minute now. It's frost covering absolutely everything. So yeah, just waiting for it to snow. It's only a matter of days, hours even. I have a cold, but that's not stopping me. It's about zero degrees at the moment outside. Minus three when we woke up this morning. You forget how fresh this morning air is. Can you imagine how cold that water is? I've lost my voice. I think this cold is finally catching up with me. It's, it's zero degrees right now. It's fine, it's great. But um, yeah, I've lost my voice, so I really need to go and rest. It's 7.30 p.m. and it's snowing. It's so beautiful. Let's have a look. The snow is now slush, but we've still got a week of cold weather ahead. It's warmed up actually. As you can see, the sun's out and it's about 11 degrees at the minute. Christmas Eve Eve. Next time you see us, we'll be at Winter Wonderland. Christmas. It's 
Christmas Day today, and it's day 75, three quarters of the way through the challenge. It's uh, quite overcast overhead, but let me show you anyway. Cloudy, windy, and bitterly cold Essex. Christmas already feels like quite a while ago. Yeah, it's a lot colder than it would be in London. The winds are here. It's going to be proper windy now for the next few days. It's been raining pretty much constantly since last night. We're going to a special location tomorrow for New Year's Eve. The next time you see me, I'll be there. In fact, in Paris. Unbelievably quiet but it's absolutely beautiful. Welcome back to London. It's wet, it's windy and we're going out for Ban Mi. You know what actually the weather is improving. It really is. Should really take this Christmas tree down. Maybe tomorrow. Surprise surprise it's raining. Come check this out. Yeah, it seems like the nights are getting darker. Obviously they're not, but it does feel that way. It's not pleasant out there, I'll tell you. Recently it's become proper winter again. We've had some really nice days of 12 degrees. Um, quite placid weather, but it's, it's wet, it's windy. It's proper filthy out there. I just went for a run and yeah, I almost got blown into the road. It's pretty crazy at the moment and no signs of it stopping anytime soon. Um, so yeah, January so far uh, is very, very, very windy. The wind's finally dying down, but still a bit too windy to be out and about without getting blown everywhere. That's seven degrees outside at the minute and I think it's probably going to be the same for next week as well. Wow, after today we've only got two days left. Let's go and see what the weather's doing, eh? Why not? So good news is the wind's finally died down. Uh, it's quite placid outside, actually. Not too cold. Honestly, it's just a very, very mild day, about nine or 10 degrees and uh, no wind, thankfully. this morning. It's strange because the challenge comes to an end tomorrow and 
Seems like we're having a, another cold snap. I believe it, 100 days of London weather. How are things different? Surprising actually, the weather's not made as bad as I thought it would be. So London you pleasantly surprised me. In these 100 days we've been to Cornwall, we enjoyed Paris twice. It's been a pretty epic 100 days to be honest. And um, yeah, goodbye for now, but here's hoping the next 100 will be just as amazing. Um, thanks for joining us. would have been day number 104 and just wanted to check in as I was missing doing the video a little bit we've had constant freezing cold weather ever since we started the video just to Heathrow Airport it's incredibly misty come check it out so anyway, thanks again for joining us for the video and we'll see you soon Up. Thank you. Jesus Christ. <laughs> it's <out> the piss. <laughs>